is let's do u plus v. Let's make it simple. Okay? So to evaluate for u plus v, all we're simply going to do is add the components of u and then add the components of v. And just like the notes that I had for you guys, all we simply need to do is just add u1 and v1 and then add u2 and v2. Does everybody agree with me? So in this case, it's basically going to be vector u plus negative 3 comma negative 1 plus 2. So therefore, that gives me negative 1 comma negative 1. That is my vector u plus b. Yes? I don't know. It should be positive 1, right? Negative 1, positive 1. That is your vector u plus v. Okay? So a lot of times, what we look at is we just label this. So if you're going to label this, you just label this u, times v, u plus v. Now, I want you guys to have a visual understanding, because sometimes what they might ask you is just to actually represent this on, on the graph, or just knowing what this uh, graphically is going to be. So sometimes it's helpful to actually graph both of these separately. So let's graph 2, negative 1. So if I graph 2, negative 1, that'd be over 2, down 1. So that is a, that's v, u. And then v is negative 3, 2. What am I doing? That's the other way. What the heck's wrong with me? And then v is negative 3, positive 2. Does everybody see that? Now. One of the ways that I want you guys to kind of see what we do when we're doing vector addition and subtraction, one of the things that we do is we use what we call a tail to head kind of method. So what you can do is when you're trying to identify the addition of two vectors, if you take your vector u and if we put vector v on top of it, what you guys will see is if you do u, and then put v on top of it, that gives you your vector u plus v in the black. Do you guys see that? Yeah, well, because look at what's v. Remember, v is what? Negative 3, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, up 2. See how when I put u, when I put v, when I put the tail at the head, the tail of v at the head of u and add it to there, it takes me back to my same one. Does everybody see that? Yeah. So it's what we just call our um, tail to head addition. So when you're doing addition, basically all you simply need to do is just put one vector on top of the other vector, and that will take you to the same, it'll give you the same terminal point. Okay? You could also just add the components and then figure out what the component form is going to be. But I wanted you guys to be able to see that. Okay, Anthony? Good. 